Hello everybody and welcome to Doc Brown's Radio Lab. This is going to be a quick test of my brand new panel, which is a... give you three seconds to guess. It is a... Simplex 4005 Fire Alarm Control Panel. That's right. I have a Simplex 4005 and this is going to be a quick test of it. For devices, we have my new to me Gentex Commander horn strobe. Get focused in on that. There we go. So yeah, I have a Gentex Commander horn strobe up there. I'm, I'm sorry, just a strobe. It's just a remote strobe, not a horn strobe. Um, and then I have my same old um, Simplex True Alarm. And then we have my conventional 4250-120 pole station. And then of course the 4005. Just a quick little mini demo system I made. So I'm going to go ahead and dial my focus back in here. And we'll go ahead and give you a little quick look at the inside. Let's go ahead and open it up here. Okay. So as we can see, here's the inside of the 4005. Go ahead and get a good look at that. I'm trying out a new camera, by the way, too, and I'm using manual focus, so I'm just kind of getting used to that. Okay, there we can see the inside. We have two zone cards, so we have a total of eight zones. I'm, I'm sorry, we actually have three zone cards. We have a total of 16 zones, so there's two, two zone cards on the first and second slot. The third slot has a dual... Um, it has a relay or a NAC card, so I have it set up to have two NACs and two relays. And then that last card on the bottom, that's an additional zone card. I did get some extra cards with this panel. I have another uh, dual relay zone card here. I have, uh, I think it's a rarer card. It is a combination two zone and two relay or NAC card, both into one card. I have that one. And then I have a spare zone card, as you can see. And I'm not using those three just because I didn't need that many cards. But this panel does have a, uh, it's got an auxiliary relay board in it, and it's got a second power distribution board on the right, on the left side, so we could add more expansion cards if we wanted to. So with that being said, we're just going to go ahead and give this panel a real quick test. So. Here we go. We're going to pull the pull station and you'll see it go off in the fire alarm. And here we go. Three, two, one. There we go. We have an alarm. And if we look at our signal, it is flashing. We'll get in nice and close and we'll go ahead and acknowledge that. And let me grab my keys, and we will reset the pull station. Oh, and I must have tripped it again, because that happens sometimes. Because these panels do have zone re-alarm. And as you can see, I.O. card 4, input 1, biomonitor zone, alarm 1 out of 1. I did not uh, do any custom labeling yet to um, label the zones, but that can be done, of course. So we'll go ahead and hit alarm silence. Alarm silence completed. Restore previous screen. Press any key. And we already reset the pull station, so I guess we'll go ahead and do a system reset. System reset in progress. Restore previous screen. Press any key. And of course, the 4005's notorious long reset time. We'll go ahead and wait for that. And there we go, the panel has reset. So now to end things off, I'll give you a quick look at the uh, data tag here on the door. You can see that, Simplex Time Recorder Company. This panel was made in 1996, which is actually the same year as my uh, 4004. 
which if you haven't seen, I do have a 4004 right over there. That's hooked up to its own little mini demo system. And then there's, of course, the door of the 4005. And yeah, I'm sure you guys have all seen a 4005 before. So that was just a quick little mini system test of the 4005. Uh, thank you guys very much for watching. And I guess I'll point out here before I end the video that I got this 4005. Very thanks to my friend Ryan over at his channel, MSJ191961. Uh, he came over to visit the other day and he got me this 4005, which I really appreciate. Once again, Ryan, thank you very much for the 4005. And I'm really happy to own one of these 4005 panels now because I've wanted one for quite a while and I think it kind of goes well with the 4004. They kind of go together because they were both released at the same time by Simplex. The 4004 was designed for smaller applications. Well, the 4005 was designed for slightly larger um, configurations, which that's why it's expandable up to 36 zones and it is so expandable is because you could have different option cards for different... Uh, installations based on the customer's needs. So thank you guys very much for watching this quick test and stay tuned for more content in the future. We'll have more tests of the 4005 as well as the 4004 and all my other panels. Oh yeah, and one more thing I did forget to mention was that uh, this is where the 2001 was, but don't worry the 2001 isn't going anywhere. It's on the floor for now just because I didn't have much room left on my walls anymore to put up so many panels so I decided to take down the 2001 and throw up the uh, 4005 up there in its place for right now but I do plan on hooking up the 2001 again for a mini system and who knows I'm thinking I might even down the road here uh, you can see the 4010 over there I might even put the 4005 right right up here somewhere maybe even move the 4010 over and put the 4005 over here and then you know, I could put the 2001 back where it was over there or put something else up or just kind of depends on how things go. So thank you guys very much for watching and I'll see you next time. Have a nice day, everyone.